welcome back now in this video i will show you how to convert the collection into array and how to iterate the same so let's do the same thing practically can we convert this collection into array yes you can for example let me save this as demo number three students please see carefully suppose if you want to convert this your collection into array then instead of iterator you can write over here that is object array is equal to c dot two array is the function so you can say two array is the function which is available in the collection which is used to convert your collection into array so what happened once it is converted into array i can get the each and every index for example if i am writing here system dot out dot print line o a r r of 0 then i will be able to get the 100 if i am writing here o a r r that is object a r r of 1 then i will be able to get the true you can save this you can compile this program that is demo 3 dot java and you can run this demo 3 you will be able to get this see here 100 and true suppose if you think that sir i want to get the third index that is the 0 1 2 and 3 that is 3.14 and i want the fifth index that is the sixth element that is the atmi university then you can compile and run you will be able to get this see here 3.14 and atmi university so if you want to access the index of any element from your collection then you can convert your collection into array and then you can get the index but if it is a array list instead of this collection if it is an array list then you can access the index using the index of function and even you can get the element based on the index using the function get so you just need to provide the index and you can get the element now suppose if you think that sir i want to print each and every element of this object array is it possible yes it is possible for example here you can write the for each loop you can write here object o colon object array so you can retrieve each and every element for example if you are writing system dot out dot print line o then all the element will be displayed over here you can save this you can compile your code and you can run this see here you can retrieve each and every element so either you can use the iterator to retrieve this or you can convert it into array and you can retrieve it so this is the way you can convert the collection into array so that's it from my side if you like this video then please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you very much have a nice day